All right, folks, here is a live, beautiful view over East Grand Rapids this morning where young people will start to head back to class this morning. And as kids return to school this week, you can expect to see a lot more cars and buses on the roads. Our Brittany Flowers joins us live from East Grand Rapids High School with a very good reminder for all those drivers out there. Brett, what should they keep in mind? Yeah, of course, you're probably used to the cars that are on the road as you head into work, uh, either in the morning or the afternoon. But buses are going to be a big thing starting this week as many districts head back to school. So we want to give you a few reminders of what to keep in mind as you see more of those buses out on the roadways. First, if a bus is stopped to pick up a kid, never pass it. Second, you should think of school buses like traffic signals. So if you see yellow flashing lights, you should start preparing to stop. And when you see them red, you should stop at least 20 feet away from the bus. The only exception is if you're going the opposite way on a divided highway. Now, if the bus's hazard warning lights are flashing, proceed with caution and always watch for children that might be walking between things like parked cars, for instance. A couple of things that wouldn't hurt to go over with your kids before they head to the bus stop. They should always stay in sight of the bus driver and they should not hurry off the bus. It's extremely important to get uh, check traffic first before stepping off the bus and students should never go back to that bus after they exit it. The majority of bus related deaths and injuries involve pedestrians, mostly children who are hit or injured when they're exiting to cross traffic. And a final reminder for drivers, if you do pass a bus with flashing red lights, you could be charged with a civil infraction. Fines for that range from $100 to $500. And those cameras make it easier to track the person who the car is registered to. So be sure that you're being mindful of that. You could also be required to perform 100 hours of community service at a school if you fail to stop. Live in East Grand Rapids, Brittany Flowers, News 8.